Okay, folks, <clears throat> here we are. We're going to uh, do a little demo of the Tesla Model S hidden menu screen. Um, we're in a Model S performance right now. Uh, down here, we got the web browser up showing the local weather. And uh, here's some energy consumption we've done over the past uh, 15 miles or so. Uh, but the real interesting part here is at the top, you can see the Tesla logo here. And what we're going to do is press on this for a few seconds. And then when we let go, a new screen pops up here that says, please enter your access code. Now okay, so uh, after the password's put in correctly, um, you'll see the first screen show up. And you can see some settings that are not normally available on the Model S, uh, specifically looking at the rate Sport Torque and uh, limit top speed. Those options are not normally available um, in the main menus. <clears throat> On the next screen here, uh, you can see under the app section, some apps that are not available yet. Uh, there's an image viewer, uh, a sketch pad, which might be for drawing on the 17-inch um, touchscreen. There's a scheduler icon that looks kind of like an iCal, Apple-esque kind of icon there. And um, there's also some other testing things here as uh, animation test, audio test, voice recognition, and uh, some navigation tests as well. The next screen here um, shows the car configuration, um, which some interesting points here are the blind spot detection, uh, adaptive cruise control, and the lane departure warning. Um, all of which are currently not available in the Model S, uh, but certainly would be desirable features to have. And it looks like Tesla definitely has these in the works. Um, and I guess we'll hope to see them soon. The fourth screen here, um, which I think I've seen around before, is a uh, looks like a diagnostic uh, screen showing status and temperatures of the battery, HVAC system, uh, temperatures of the motors, the drive inverter, um, as well as uh, some other features here.